Hi, Konnichiwa. So today we're going to be playing a game called Hearthstone, but I've set my Hearthstone to Japanese because this is one thing I've found that can really help you improve your Japanese is it's constantly being exposed to Japanese every single day. All right, make it part of your life. Um, I have all kinds of techniques, like when I wake up in the morning, my and I turn my computer on, my browser is the home page is set to Asahi Shimbun. So the first thing I see is uh, Japanese. My phone's in Japanese. I just try and do all these things which expose me to Japanese constantly so that it becomes natural for me to read it and listen to it and understand it. So we're going to be playing through the offline mode, I guess, the story mode of this. Uh, here we can see it's Sodo Adventure. Now, um, I'm going to be playing on the hard difficulty, which is called Heroic or something, I think. Heroic. Alright, and uh, I mean, this game is already kind of hard, but uh, in heroic mode, it, it's kind of cruel. But I've already done part of this, but we'll, we'll, uh, we'll do chapter 4, because we haven't done this yet. Alright, so I'll do my best to explain what's going on, but uh, bear in mind, that this, it's, this game is quite hard to, to read sometimes. So... I guess we'll just go with what we've got on our screen. Oh man, I think I'm really going to struggle with some of this. Because I, I tend to read it inside my head a lot. Yeah, whether that's right or not is is something altogether different. Alright, so first we have Yom. Kigen no Den Do. Alright, and Kigen is like the origin of something. And Den Do, this is just a palace basically. Uh, this Den is kind of a hard country. Uh, the Do comes from words like Shokudo and stuff. Okay. And then we've got uh, Ikari no saiyaku ni shori suru tame Seinaru dendo no kyodai na Shugosha tachi o taoso Alright, Ikari no saiyaku um, I think s s this is the name of the boss I think But Ikari is rage or anger and saiyaku is like a Like a disaster or something Shori suru tame, well, shori is to to win, right? So shori suru tame, for the sake of winning, or victory, I guess. Seinaru dendo, so seinaru is like divine, um, and uh, dendo is the same word we had up here. Uh, so the the divine palace, no kyo, uh, kyodai na shugosha tachi. So kyodai is like a giant, big thing, like kore desu ne. And Shugosha, well, Shugo is to protect something or defend something, and Sha is a person, right? So Shugosha, a, um, a defender or some, some type, protector. And Tachi is just a plural, and Tao So. And Tao Su is to um, kind of defeat something, to like knock it over kind of thing. So Tao So is just what's called our plain form volitional. So let's, um, let's knock him over. So. A lot of you may be not so familiar with this plain form volitional, but it's really worth um, studying. Take him, has got some great material on it, but uh, you might recognize it better as Tawashimashou. Same thing. Okay, now uh, just a bit of background with this game. It's basically a card game, and this solo mode, um, there's all types of restrictions and changes from the normal gameplay, and so in this one, we got Don Den Kaishi, Ikari no Minion. So this Don Den Kaishi is kind of the the um, the change that this uh, the the little weird thing that happens just in this chapter four thing actually. And we have Ikari no Minion, and Minion is our minions, right? Our basically the the cards we're gonna play. Uh, well, the people anyway. We have spells and minions basically. Uh, and Ikari uh, is the same way we saw up here, Rage. And so what happens here, you'll see, is that when a minion takes damage, uh, it still takes the damage, but its its attack goes up. Okay, so it's like a raging minion. It'll get stronger and stronger the more damage it takes. Now, we've also got this Sombiaku now, this 300. This is actually the final boss's health. Uh, we're not going to get here for a while. I think we have to defeat eight people, and he's the eighth one. Or this, whatever it is, is the eighth one. But every time we take health off him it actually saves it so even if the boss defeats you you can go back and you know do it so um, normally it 
takes me quite a few goes to to win this. I very very highly doubt I'm going to get it this time. Um, but the last boss of chapter three, I actually killed him in one go, all 300 health. I was pretty impressed with that. I was luckily able to generate a lot of cards and all that kind of good stuff. And I I got a bit lucky actually, but I don't want to talk about that. <laughs> but basically, I got lucky. Oh, I've never even seen this before. I've never actually noticed this before. Anyway, we don't need this. <laughs> I don't really like that uh, because it's going to apply to me as well. Because it's just a minion. And I have minions, so that'll put bombs in my deck. Let's not do that. Alright, now I'm going to uh, play this on kind of easy mode. But I've found that this character is, is super good. Um, and so they are Dorui do Puri Stop. And so again, this game mode is a little bit different. So this character has both Druid and um, Priest. Uh, priest and Druid um, class cards. Uh, but the only reason we're going to pick her... I forgot, I forgot to read her name. Um, so we got Kyofu no Isan. Hiroiku Aiyo no Takaramono o Irande Kure. Okay, and basically I picked this card, I uh, picked this hero, sorry, because she gets this. Alright. So, again, real basic Hearthstone explanation. So, this number up here is the, the mana, okay? So, you get a certain amount of mana you can use per turn. Uh, this is the sword thing, this is the attack. Alright, ma kore mana desne mana crystal. And they call this Kogeki or Kogeki ne, I can't remember, but the attack. Alright, so this is three damage every time I hit something. And then this is the I guess you call it Seme or Inochi or something. It's got six life. Okay. Now in this box here you will have uh, some kind of effect that the card has. And this is what's called an Osakebi. I think also you can read it as Otakebi. I'm not too sure which one but this to me this is sakebu but anyway so this is what in english we call a battle cry and in this game a battle cry means that when you play the card uh, from your hand and you play it then it, it does something and what this does it says teki no minion subete o jibun no deki ni mazeru all right so teki this is a word that's going to come up a lot this is enemy so teki no minion so the enemy minions subete all of them o jibun no deki so we have two places that cards are going to come from, kind of, in this game. We have our Aran Deki, our deck, and we have our Tefuda, which is the hand that you can see down the bottom. Not yet. Um, and so this card takes all the enemy minions and puts them into my deck. And it's, it's, it's really crazy. The fact that it only costs three mana is nuts as well. One of the games I played recently, I was actually able to copy this and put it back into my hand so that I could play it again. But it's basically what's called a board clear, and uh, that's super important in this game. Alright, so we've got Sentaku, so let's choose this one. Now we've got, then we've also got a choice of a hero power. Um, it doesn't really matter which one you choose so much, they're all pretty good. Um, so we've got Iri is no Chikara, Star Shika. So, a hero power, you can generally use it once per turn, but whatever. Uh, this one, though, we see that th these have got mana costs, but this one doesn't. Um, so this means it just gets activated on certain conditions, whereas this one you have to use. Okay, so hero power, sentaku, so this is our choice. Kono turn no aida, so during this turn. Kogeki ryoku plus ni, matawa, soko o ni kakutoku suru. Alright, so you got a choice, Konota no Aida, during this turn, have two attack. That means at the end of the turn it disappears, so you have to attack where it's kind of a waste. Matawa, otherwise, the other choice. So ko, so this is basically armor. So ko ni kakutoku suru, so gain two armor. And that is not just this turn, okay, because we've got a full stop, which is saying Konota is just for the attack. Okay, so this is not a bad one because armor is, is really useful. And sometimes having to attack that you can aim is, is quite good. Um, this one is not bad. Now this next one, I'm actually not entirely sure how to read this, but I think it's Jodo Kata or Jodo K. Not sure, but 
Um, this basically means uh, it's like it's not one that you use, it's just always active so that when you meet the condition it, it gets triggered. So Ngata is a type, so it's like a, this type of hero power rather than a select hero power. So Jibun ga ichi tan chu ni jumo no nikkai shiyo shita to tsuki no hono o ichi mai o jibun no tefuta ni tsuika suru. Okay, so, so Jibun ga, so yourself ga ichi tan chu ni, so during one turn, jumo no nikkai shiyo shita to after using two spells. Tsuki no ho, so um, Moonfire. Ichi mai, so one one card, alright? We're going to be using a counter of mai a lot in this game because we count cards with ichi mai. So it's a flat object, right? So ichi mai o jibun no tefuda, so your own hand ni tsuika suru added, okay? So basically you cast two spells and then you get a Moonfire. Now the thing about this is Moonfire is also a spell. So um, what I tend to do is keep one in a Moonfire in my hand, then I only have to cast one spell in the turn, and then I get an, uh, then I cast a Moonfire, and then I get an extra Moonfire. So it's kind of like getting, and the Moonfire costs zero mana, so it's getting basically free one damage every turn, um, kind of. This is alright, as long as you got a lot of spells in your deck, but it tends not to get used a lot actually, I find. Um, I find that this one is better. Uh, next one we got... Uh, Okay, so Taryoku, this is our life, right? This is the word I forgot, but this is the life of something. And so as a hero, you also have life down here. We got 15 life, it'll increase every round. But ni uh so Taryoku ni kaifuku. Now kaifuku is to heal, right? So ni kaifuku to heal for two. Shitato, so once you've healed for two, because that's what this hero power does. Taisho, which is the target, ga uh, Taryoku Zenkai nara. So if you're at full health, card o ichimai hiku, you'll pull a, you'll draw a card. Okay, so this is, it's quite useful because you can heal minions, and minions are very likely to get to full health with a, t a, a t heal of two a lot of times. So it's a good way to draw cards. But we're actually going to go for the armor because I like having armor. Alright, so we've got these kind of uh, pre made decks, but I don't really like any of these. So I'd only just choose the, um, the random deck and I mean because it's random you do get some very bizarre things sometimes and they're useless and you lose but sometimes you get very good cards so we can see we got random na card no deki de chosen kaishi all right so start the battle with random cards but the thing is once it's once it's selected your cards in after I've pressed go you will have those same cards every battle by the way so anyway so sentak we kind of choose our random deck and we see we got um, uh, bosu no kazu. the amount of bosses I've killed, 150, right? So I have played this quite a lot. It's really hard to pass, by the way. It's really hard. And I th this counts all the other chapters as well, but I probably should stop playing this game so much. But it is good. I, th I think of it as Japanese practice, ne? All right, and we got Koryaku uh, Kanyo Kaisu. All right, so a Koryaku is kind of the campaign. Uh, so this is what this game is, and so kanryu, kanryo kaisu, so kaisu is the amount of times, and kanryo is to complete. So koryaku kanryo kaisu is the amount of times I've completed a whole chapter. And I've actually done it three times with this character, so you can see why I keep choosing her. So um, just this, this card is, this adora is, is just too good. It's just too powerful. Needs to get nerfed. I don't even know if this is in the single player game. I, I would wonder if it is. Okay, so we've got a challenge Ichi no Hachi no Ichi. Ichiban. I don't know exact, exactly how to read that. But uh, we got I Dora. And then it just kind of describes her. But normally we mouse over this to see the um, her hero power. So she's got a cost of one. Mihari no uh, To. Alright, so we've basically got our, our first problem here. I'm not exactly sure how to read that. I mean, Tor, this, I can't do it at the same time, but the thing with fire on the left um, is, uh, it means lamp, but I just looked it up. You can read it a few other ways, but we'll just say it's read as Tor now. So, uh, we can see it's one cost, you know, the, the hero powers that they have are crazy, so it only costs one mana. Ichi ichi no wisp wo ittai shoukan suru. Sore ni seimei. Dashu wo fuyo suru. 
Okay, so it's it's you know wisp wisp, you know, a wisp. It's like um you can kinda of see it in the picture there. It's a little elven spirit or something. So it's 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 so one one wisp, so one attack, one uh life wisp or Ittai shotai shou kansuru, sorry. So ittai is you know that tai kanji is karada. Okay, so one body shokansuru and shokan is to kind of invite or to I think summon it really means. So you summon a, a minion. There's sore ni, and so the sore is referring to the wisp, right? So sore ni to the wisp. Seme dashu. Now seme dashu is life steal, right? Seme life dashu is to steal something basically to 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 take it away. So seme dashu life steal. So basically, when they attack, they get your hero gets healed for the amount of attack that they do. So a one one wisp is going to give you one one health every time it attacks. And then through your suru, so to attach, right? So give the one one miss one one wisp life steal. Okay, so now we got pude. And these are all jokes, by the way. They're they're hard to explain. Must mean ten That was a good one. All right. All right, so we'll just go for some. All right, so basically, I always want to get this in the hand. So if, if it looks like I'm going to die, I can just throw this out and get rid of all their minions. Okay, so what do we got? Maho no watari garasu. All right, so here, it's we see down the bottom here. It says uh, kemono. Uh, we've got kemono, so this is a beast, but it doesn't have any ability, right? It's a pretty low value card. We talked about this. Miho no minion itai ni tsuki kara no mana crystal hitotsu kakutoksuru. Whoa, that's a pretty good card. So when I have a lot of minions, I want to throw that out there and I'll get empty crystals, which is pretty amazing actually. I've got another o takebi. Jibun no tefuta ni kosto ko no ijo no jumo ga aru bai ni ni no torrent o nittai shoukan suru. That's pretty good. I should have a spell of cost five eventually. All right, but we've only got this for now. The turn is over. The finish. Then we got Teki no turn. This is a torrent, kind of. Wow. All right, so we've got not much to do here, but this guy's only got ten health. So normally, if you attack it, Tanken Dome. So that's kind of the name of this uh, expansion. Tank and Dorme, it's like, it's, um, in English they call it the saviors of Oldum or something, but Tanken is an explorer and Dorme is an alliance, so Tanken and Dorme, uh, the alliance, oh, do I want to do this now? I think so. Alright, so, I mean, okay. Guessing it's gonna attack this. Let's see if we can see our Ikari no minion, but he's, it's over for him. <laughs> okay, that was pretty easy. Although I do lose a lot on that first one sometimes because they just they got crazy stuff sometimes. But shorty, all right, I win. All right, we're doing well. Only seven more. Okay, so now between every turn you, you can kind of do stuff. Between every boss, sorry. So we got Takara Mono Erande Kure. Erande Kure. So choose it for me. Alright, as in the person who's speaking. Choose it for me. Erande Kure really is what they're saying. So pick something, basically. So we've got uh, these. Um, these are Takara Mono are treasures. They're different from uh, normal cards. So for example, we see I've got a treasure already. This one we always start with the treasure, and this is that ikari no minion, right? So minion ga damage o uketa ato. So when after a minion receives damage, sore wa so to that minion, kogeki ryoku plus ichi o kakutoku suru. All right, so gain one attack. All right, so that that's that's what these do as well. It's just when the condition is satisfied, it happens. So what do we got? Uh, well, I've I've. I actually can't read this. I've, I've looked it up. I found the kanji, but it's not an entry in the dictionary, which is always fun. 
but if I had to rate it, I mean, <laughs> Bokujo, Maki, Makitsuzue. No idea. It's like a shepherd's staff or something, but this doesn't look like a shepherd's staff. Farming staff. Tor. Uh. Koku. I don't even know that character. Anyway, sorry, I can't read it. <laughs> if, if you guys can read it, please tell me. Uh, Joji Hatsudo. Alright, so again, it just is. Okay, so we got Jibun ga Jumo Shio Stato, Jibun no Deki Kara, Minion Itayo, Chinchi, Niok. I'm actually not sure about that. I think that's Chinchi. But Jibun ga Jumo no Shio Stato, so one after you use a spell, Jibun no Deki Kara, so from the deck, Minion Itayo, Chinchi Niok. So place a minion on the battlefield. Uh, this is a really good one. I'm probably going to pick this. I don't like this one, and I don't like that one either. So we got Georgi Hatsudo Taisen no Kaishi Ji Random ni Mitsu no Himitsu o Junbi suru. So Taisen no Kaishi Ji at the beginning of the match of the battle. Random ni, so randomly. Mitsu no Himitsu, so three secrets. And a secret is basically a spell which um, activates on certain things. They can be good, they can be bad. Or oh, Junbi suru. There is some very good secrets, but because they're random, it's, it's kind of, unless I've got um, some reason I normally don't pick this because it's 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 kind of good to protect you in the early game but most of the time it sucks um, and we got Toki Hanatare da Kanose so Taisen no Kaishi Ji at the beginning of the battle Jibun no Kaku Minion so all of your minions no Koryo Kogeki Ryoku wo sono Taeryoku to onaji ni suru so put the attack the same as the health that's just not good all right so we'll go with this one this is really good so now basically i want to fill my deck with really crazy good minions uh and what well, lots of low cost spells so it's kind of hard to do that because i can only pick from three choices all right so now we got senri hino randekure all right so senri hin um i had to look this up but it's the spoils of war so basically, because I won, I get to choose some more cards. Alright, so we've got three, toru toru toru, and we won't worry about the names, but we've got... Alright, so this is good because it's a one-cost spell, another low-cost spell. Alright, those look pretty good, but I've got no good minions to pop out. So... Hmm, these are all pretty good. I like having dragons as well. These are good for choice cards, but... Ooh, that'll be pretty good actually. Alright, let's do it. So we got a, again, a, a choice card, a sentaku, so minion itai o hakken suru. So discover a minion, matawa jumon hitotsu o hakken suru. So discover a spell. So it's good because I get two spells out of it. Um, so I get two minions on the board. Hakken, ah, sorry, sentaku card o ichimai o hakken suru. So discover a selection card. 自分の選択カードとヒーローパワーの効果を選べる2つの効果を組み合わせるものになる。Oh、合わせたものになる。That's really good. So, this synergizes really well with these two, but the effects of choice cards and hero powers, if there's two choices, two effects, sorry, both of those effects get put together. So, for example, every time I use this, I'm going to get both two attack and two armor, and I'll be able to this one I'll get both a minion and a spell so let's do this all right that's <laughs> that's kind of funny actually all right all right well, I'll keep that so we got our discover out selection um dis discover a selection card so mikata no minion itta yo sentaku suru so no minion no ichichi no copy wo shoukan suru so pick a friendly minion and it has to be on the board right pick a friendly minion um, summon a 1 1 copy. That could be good depending on what you summon. We talked about that. That's a really good card. So, mana crystal or niko kakutoku suru. Alright, so we see my, I summoned a minion. It's it's pretty powerful. Um, and this is a good minion because this is a um, what's called um, ma, it's in, in Japanese it's geki day. 
but it's um, inspire. So every time you do a hero power, something happens. And in this instance, my hero gains two attack for that turn. So it's not bad. And this is uh, mana crystal. Ma kore desu ne. Mana crystal. Crystal. Uh, o niko kakutoku suru. So get two mana crystals. Mata wa kado san mai hiku. So otherwise, draw three cards. But of course, if we combine it with uh, this thing, we'll get both. Th th both of those are really good. So, he's getting a miscreant. Alright, so basically we want to clear this because we'll get more attack. And we want four attack. Alright, so he's pretty much dead next turn. <laughs> it's pretty funny. It's not normally this easy, by the way. Normally I I lose quite a lot. Oh, I just put it. So this is a taunt. Which is Chohatsu. How am I going to get around that? Oh, I guess I can just do this. Alright. Getting pretty lucky. That was a very good minion to draw off the uh, Inspire. Okay, so now we notice this time I don't get I don't get the Takara Mono now. I just get to choose cards. So I've got a fair few spells. Actually, I don't have that many at all. I've only got three, four. All right, so I probably need some more spells. Healing. Oh, that's pretty good. Alright, this is... I mean, I'm, I probably should spend a lot more time. When I play this, I, I definitely don't read enough. But this is, again, we got two spells and a minion. And this is a good minion because the effect... Jibun ga jumon o tsukao tabi random mana priest no jumon ichimai o jibun no tefuta ni tsukasuru. So, basically, when this card is on the field and I play a spell... I will get a random spell into my deck, so that's that's quite amazing for this um, this uh, Takara Mono. And then we've got Minion Ittai ni Taiyoku Plus ni o Fuyosuru Card o Ichimahiku. So give a minion to health, draw a card. Yep. Uh, so now we got this one Minion Ittai ni Yomi Gaeri o Fuyosuru. And it's actually a new effect for this game. If you guys have played this before, this is a in the new expansion, but it's uh, Resurrection, Yomigairu. So, and we got Bofu no Gishiki. Alright, so that would be a good one. And I already mentioned this. And we see this star means it's a legendary minion, so it's kind of good. Alright, let's do it. Got also one cost spell is quite good for this. Oh, I didn't look at his, this person's hero power. This is one Osechichu, setting a trap. I remember this guy. So, uh, <laughs> it's supposed to be a joke, right? Armadillo ro 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 robot and Armadillo robot. Okay, that's pretty good. And I. Sorry, would you? Let's leave that. That'll be good later. Gotta wait till some minions to die for that one. Do really good. Okay, sweet. I um. I think this is actually a, a joke. Maybe I'm wrong, but. I mean, you would, if you had to read this, it would be uh, Mecha no Soju. And if you just heard that, Soju is manipulation or operating something. So Mecha no Soju, manipulating mechs, right, mechanical stuff. But what they've done is, uh, and this is something you can do in, in Japanese a lot, but, you know, you can take a kanji which has the same reading. So in this instance, it's the second one, the Ju. And we actually read that as Kemono, which is a beast. So it's like manipulating the beasts. Manipulating a mechanical beast. So, Konota no Aida, so during this turn. Mecha Ittai ni, so it kind of makes sense. Kogeki ryoku plusu ni o fuyoshi, so add to attack. Randamu no teki no minion Ittai o kogeki saseru. Wow, so add to attack to a random friendly mech. And then, it doesn't say friendly, but I'm guessing it's friendly. Um, 
cause it to attack a random enemy minion. That's what that Saseru is. Um, allow it to attack or cause it to attack. Ooh. Okay, so that kind of makes sense that it is a joke. Okay. Quite like this one. So, this is a uh, Kyushu or Motsu Yon no Ni no Minion Ni Henshin Suru. So, turn into a 4 2 minion with Rush. Atawa Cho Hatsu or Motsu Ni no Yon no Minion Ni Henshin Suru. So, change into a 2 4 Taunt. It's quite a nice card actually. Shinonzoku Mikato no Minion Ni Prasutu Prasutu. Oh. It's not a bad one, but it's 9 mana. I'm probably not going to be able to use it. Mm, let's take the rush. Sweet. Oh man, I'm getting really lucky with these draws. Oh wow, that's amazing. Oh, that's amazing as well. Alright, but unfortunately... Oh, no, it's card and hero power. Oh, this, this would work, I guess. Okay, yeah, it shows with green. That's good. So, always attack with the rush minions. I don't really like leaving minions. And it's worth, kind of worth attacking because you get um, more attack. <laughs> so this is Minion Itai no Ko Geku Ryoku or Tai Ryoku to Onaji Ne Nikaido, I'm not sure if you read that as Ne But change one minion's attack to the same as its health So I don't want to do it here because he's got less health than attack But here he had uh, less attack than health Alright, that's pretty good Wait, what happened to my... Oh, he killed it Maybe I should stream this all the time I never normally have this easy of a go Alright, so we've got some pretty good choices here now, because we're back to our Takara Mono, alright? So this is the really good cards. So we have Zephyris no Ramp. Taisen Kaishi ji Kore o Hiku Shori no Kado no Negae o Kanaeru? Kana? Kanaeru to wish. Alright, so Kanaeru Negae o Kanaeru to grant a wish. Shorty card, or a victory card. Um, I'm not exactly... I should look up how this works, but I, I think there is a bit of... Um, what happens with this card? And it says Koreo Hiku, so Taisen Kaishiji. So basically you draw it at the beginning of the match, um, regardless. But because it, it, it allows you to wish for a perfect card, so I think the game kind of looks at the, the game situation and goes, okay, this person, this player really needs this card right now. I'm not sure if that's how it works, but that's how it tends to work out a lot. It always tends to give you quite good cards that you need in that situation. But also it's a zero cost spell, which is good. It's Moeru Taiyo no Ken Tsurugi kana. Hmm, it's pretty Tsurugi. Anyway, so uh, Burning Sun Sword. Or Takebi. Jiben no deki no minion subete ni kogeki ryoku plus two wo fuyo suru. That's pretty good. Dan Matsuma. Okay, so this is a good generating card because it adds two attack to all minions in my deck, alright? So basically everything that's not in my hand, which is pretty good. And then Dunmatsuma, this is a death rattle. So basically, with a, with a, this is a weapon, so I've got, it's got uh, attack and durability now. And once the durability runs out, the, the sword, um, the weapon destroys itself. And, but this, this weapon in particular, when it destroys itself, it'll actually shuffle itself back into your hand. So then you can just keep playing it and keep adding two to your deck. So that could be really good actually. But I do really like this one, and man, I can't read that at all. Alright, so the next one we have, uh, I'm probably going to pick this card, I really like it. But we got Kabuto Mushi no Kazarimono. 
And kabutomushi is a very um, common bug you get in Japan. It's a um, stag beetle or something, rhinoceros beetle or something. And kazari mono, so a, a brooch basically. And it, we see that this is a. I'm, again, I have no idea how to read it, but it's either so jumon or moro jumon. But basically, this kanji um, so is a pair. So it means you can cast the spell twice, which is crazy. So, kono taisen de shibo shita mikata no minyo o shibo shita jun ni yon tai made fukatsu saseru. So, um, bring back to life four minions that have died in order of death. So, the first one that's died gets resurrected first. I actually realize that. Sore ra ni yomi gaeri o fuyosuru. So, then attach, grant them. Um, Resurrection. I kind of want the sword actually. Getting two attack on all these minions would be pretty good. Let's do it. I don't have a weapon yet either. Alright, those are pretty good. I just want really big minions now. Yeah, these are all pretty good. Basically, I'm not really caring what their effects are. I just want big uh, minions with big health and big attack. Alright, now we're, I should have read that, but now we're going into what's called friendly encounters, so we get to kind of um, modify our deck very slightly. Not much though. So, Konkai no Adventure Deck, so this, this, this turn time rounds adventure deck, that basically our cards, or Kaizo Shio, so let's, Shio is our volitional form, right? So let's. Um, basically remodel our uh, adventure deck. Minion no tsuika, so adding a minion, ya, sakujo, or deleting nado, etc. Ga dekiru zo, because we can remove spells and all kinds of stuff as well. And dekiru, we can do it. Okay, so these are the ones we can pick from. Ooh, it's a pretty nice one. It's just the problem with this card is that if we summon it as a minion using a spell, it won't do its battle cry. And we see at the beginning that it says Saisho wa Kyu Min Jotai. So it's in like a hibernation thing. And then when it does a battle cry, it puts three uh, candles in your opponent's deck. And when they draw the three candles over time, then it wakes up. And then if it's a 2020, it's amazing, but it's kind of risky. Okay, I can't use that. That's okay. Man, they're all bad. I don't really want any of those. Okay, so I can swap out a minion. 2-2. Two, two. don't want 2-2 two, two on any of these guys. Okay, so I'll get a spell in my hand. That's a bit of mid-range. So, uh, this says, Wisp or Gotei Shō... Oh, sorry. It was Jumo no Hitotsu Hakken Suru. So, discover a spell. Sore wo jibun no adventure deki ni tsuika suru. Add it to your hand. Your deck, sorry. Sore wa, so the spell. Sore wa. So you will definitely get this in your starting hand. And then what I ended up choosing was this one. So invite five wisps. So we've got a selection thing again. Minion ittai. So one minion ni. Prasugo prasugo to chohatsu wo fuyosuru. So um, add five and five to a minion's attack and health. And give it taunt. Uh, it's not great uh, because it's six mana, so I won't be able to use it till then. But it's a good card. All right, up to four now. Oh, I remember I lost this guy before. This is a—it's just a big phase. So hero power, minion ita senda kusuru sonichi. Oh yeah, this is really annoying. This guy. He just copies his minions, and basically his deck is full of um, yomigairu minions. So, he, um, even if it's a 1-1 one -one copy, it still can resurrect itself, it's just, <laughs> it's really painful. And he ended up having these minions which can heal as well, so every time they die, they heal and they come back to life. It's like, he just had a whole board I couldn't kill and it was healing him like 20 every turn. We got Kimi no Tan. Oh man, it's not good. Although I can get this out nice and early. Yeah. 
Wait, what does this get? All oh, right, generated. Okay. Okay, so now we can see. This is what the computer is like. They just have these crazy turns all the time. Oh man. That'll be a good card once I can play it. Um. I just have to do this. I need another good minion. Uh, that's really not what I wanted. So the problem with this is I can pull out that card which removes all their minions and then the battle cry won't play. Sweet, at least that came back. <laughs> that's not looking good. Ugh, do I want to kill it? It's gonna kill me anyway. Yeah, this thing. So it's got Chohatsu, so Taunt, it's got Yomigairi, Respawn, Danmatsuma, Death Rattle. And the, the Death Rattle is Jibun no Hiro no Tairyoko San Kaifukusuru. So restore 3 health to your to the hero. And because it's got Yomigairu, it, once it dies, it responds so then it'll do it again so it actually gives six health over two turns oh man that's a good one Okay, that's really bad. I don't want to do any more damage, but I do need... Oh man. So this is more like what it normally goes like. I don't know. I've got a heal, right? Can't. Yeah. Alright, that's good. Alright. Oh no. Okay, this was gonna kill me, isn't it? Oh. <laughs> oh man. I have to attack it with that, right? Let's see what I get. Alright. Okay, okay. Oh, I can do it to mine as well? <laughs> what a joke. Alright, have I just turned this around? I think I have. <laughs> oh man, it was that it was that hero card that I needed. Click the stick with us. Alright, so we get to choose some more cards now. I really just need really good minions now. I think I've got enough spells. Oh, that's pretty nice. I do need healing. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Not great.
What do you do? 自分の武器を破壊された後、それを自分の敵に混ぜる。ピュサルタゴーガーそのまま。Oh man. So basically, this person's going to be using a lot of weapons. Every time their weapon breaks, it gets put back into their deck. And all the effects, so this is like extra attack, poison, wind fury, all these kind of things, the weapon will keep them. So this, this character is really gonna ramp like crazy. So my best chance is to be really aggressive in the beginning, I think, because this, this character is gonna suck after a while. <laughs> Uh, I can't even do anything. So he's going to play a weapon now. Alright, so this is not a bad one. Okay, it's. Okay, actually, I remember I lost to this guy last time. So he says, Jibun no hero wa kogeki suru sai ni muteki o eru. So when your hero attacks, get invincibility, which is what that blue thing around him was. And then he. Played a spell which ko geki ryoku prasu ni, so he gets plus two attack on it. And then we see it's got a dan matsuma, this skull and crossbones here, which um, uh, means that the the weapon is going to go back into his hand. All right. Okay. So th by the way, this th this card because it depends on something being in your deck, which I don't have, it's green. So it means I can play it, but if it if I had a f cost five spell, it would be yellow. So it's kind of a waste to play that right now. I really don't want to play a four cost here, but oh, let's just hit the sword. The earlier I do this, obviously, the more I get some. <sighs> this is what he did last time. He ended up having this crazy powerful sword. And in the in the game, you can um, oh, I pulled it out again. Um, in the game, you can destroy weapons, but in this one, you can't. Right, that's good. All right, so we're gonna get both of these now. Battle cries. Oh, beautiful. Hitoshi. Hmm. So this says this is again a battle cry. So Teki no Buki o Hakai Shi Sono Taikyu do ni Hisashi Maisu no Kado Hiku. So draw destroy your opponent's weapon and draw cards equal to its durability. Now the only problem is there's only one durability. But I th I think I have to do it. It's really good, mass hysteria. Perfect. I think I have to do it right. This this weapon just it killed me last time. This weapon, and he just keeps adding durability to it. I really wanted to try to kill it. See, this is this weapon, right? So, o takebi jibun no buki ni plus ichi plus ichi for your sort right? So he can just keep playing. His deck is full of weapon minions. Oh, I can get a copy of something. But do I? I don't want a copy of either of those. Well, that's good. Let's get another minion now. Beautiful. All right, that's, that's the kind of. That's why this is so good. You get minions out like that. All right, so Jiban no Tan no Shuroji, Choatsu Motsu Ichi no Ni no Uzu o Ittai Shokan. So every end of every turn, summon one of these. Uh, this is our. Uh, it's got taunt, so Chohatsu and Damatsuma, Death Rattle, so Kyumin Tai Jonyaru. So when it dies, go into hibernation. So it's different from the other card. Taiyoku uh, Gokai Kaifuk Soto, so if you heal yourself by 5, Kono Minion wa Mezhameru, it'll wake up again. Beautiful. Wait. Will this heal me 5? Alright, so it does both of them. That's ridiculous. Let's copy. It's gonna be a one-one. Um. 
Alright, it's looking pretty good. Another two. See, this is why this you gotta be you gotta get rid of these weapons, it's just Alright, so now you go into hibernation. And you can't he can't kill the hibernated thing either. Draw two cards. Yeah, well, he tried. Oh man. Smashing it. Alright, now this one is really good. I'm probably gonna pick it, but Miho no min uh Mikata no minion ga chibo starto. So every time a minion dies, get two armor. Really, really good. Jibunotan, so heal all characters for two. It's not bad because it does include your hero, so it's nice. And battle cries, but where is it? Yeah, it's not gonna help. It's not gonna help. Okay, I'll get an extra copy. I'll get an extra two treants, whatever they're called. It's not gonna matter. That'll be good. I'll get two of those. I'll get. Ooh. Oh man, that's a hard choice. Oh, it's so close, but I just don't have enough battle grass to make it worthwhile. Okay, spell damage. Pardon me, I don't think it's going to help me much. I don't do a lot of damage with spells. More dragons are always good. Life steal. So, so take all the minions. It's not bad. Yeah, it's all right. That's really good. Oh, they're all pretty nice. Let's take all of them. So I don't know why you'd ever want to do that unless you picked up some terrible minions. It gets rid of all minions below two. I don't want to do that because I like my... Miho, is it minions? No, it's just all cards. Mikata no minion, it's all cards. Ooh. Yeah, it's not bad. No, I don't want to do that. Ah, oh, that's always really good. So... Jibun no kaishi ji deki no kado, jumei no kosto, ichi mei zu, ichi... So, basically, the starting deck I had, with, which had 10 cards, reduce all those by one. Get a weapon and add 2-2 two, two to it. Yeah, sure. Terrible, because this does one damage every time you summon random and I'm, you know... It's not bad. That can be really good late in, later on. Yeah, let's try it out. Bit of fun. That's it. Maido Adi. Thank you for every time. Alright, what have you got? Taioku ni kanomi ni itta yo sentaku suru. Sono minyo yobi rinsetsu. Suru minyo hakai suru. Oh man, so he's just gonna be able to destroy minions and the ones next to them like crazy. That's not too bad for me though, because I do gain armor every time that happens, so. And the other thing is, uh, it's kind of a strategy when selecting cards because you want spells in your hand, low cost spells, and you want all your good minions to be in your deck. So, I want that to be in my deck. I want to keep that one. And that's too high of a spell. It's funny because I, I have this set in my hand every time, but I, I'm never going to keep it. Alright, that's. I'd rather he was in the deck, but that's fine. It's good to have this weapon. Alright. Just two mana. He's overloaded now. That's good. So this is Jibun ga minyo shokan shita ato taiyoku plus ichi wo kakutoku suru. So gain one health every time a minion is invited. I didn't really want to do that, but okay. So he'll be able to. Alright, that's good.
Beautiful. Okay, that's, I didn't actually do the order of that very well. But uh, it'll, it'll do. I want to keep life steal. Oh man, doing pretty well here. Oh, it's health. Oh man, that's going to be really hard to deal with. Had any good ones? Oh, I'll get another one. Ooh, crazy. I mean, it's better not to draw it like that, but. So, again, that's a bad order. I should have attacked first, but whatever. I should really be more careful. Oh man, because he destroys them as well. <sighs> okay, but I do have 23 armor now, so... Uh, let's do that first. Let's do that first. Beautiful. Alright, so I don't think I have any beasts, but this says Jibun no tefta kara kemono o ittai shoukan suru And I don't have any beasts, right? Yeah Anyway How's that not a beast? It's half human This has got to be a beast, right? Just a minion Let's just be patient. Gaman stoy to koi mashō. Well, I thought that was going to be really bad, but I got pretty lucky with my draws there. Alright. More spells. Okay, more healing. Oh, that's pretty good. So we got... Jibun ga juma no shi o suru tabi, jibun no hiro no tari o san kai fuku suru. So every time you use a spell, heal your hero by three. And this is a Geki day, so every time I use my hero power gets activated. Random Luna Jumon Ichimai o Jibun no Tefuta ni Suika Suru. So add a random spell to your hand. And we've already got one of these. It's a random priest spell to your hand. Good to have two. Alright, second last one. What have we got? Minion Itai no Tari o Ko Jogen Made Kaifuku Suru. So heal one minion to full health. That could be really annoying. But it's pretty limited. And he needs minions, of course, so... Basically, if I just keep clearing all these minions, he can't do anything. Okay, I want to draw that, and I want to keep that in my hand. Garden, garden norm. <laughs> so yeah, really, the the goal is you want to get as much armor as possible. That's how I beat the last chapter. I just had so much armor and uh, you know then you can just dump minions and you don't really care about um... oh, man この minion に sun damage I it but it didn't do it though I healed it sorry 
because yeah, you, don't, you, you just want to get trash minions out there because they, they whether they're worth one mana or ten mana they still only give you two armor so if you can have a that's why that wisp one will be good because i'll get a whole board seven wisps which will all give me armor Okay. Wow. It's actually really good to do it on that card. Because it's Aite no Tefta Ichimainitsuki Tarioko Hitotsu Ichi Ushinao. So you lose one health for every card that they have, but because he resurrected it, um, resurrected the dead minion, the battle cry doesn't affect it, so it comes back just with full health. Oh man. I just, I can't attack. It's just too, too much valley. Oh my gosh, this is, yeah, so. So basically, I'm just biding time now. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'm going to get a little bit of armor every turn, but I w really, I'm just waiting for that Adora, or whatever that person is called. Okay, so they put that into my deck. I've got enough health, I can take a few more. Oh, this is just getting ridiculous now. Nine mana already. Alright, that's pretty much over. Oh, shouldn't have attacked with that one first. How many times do you want to? How many times they cast that spell? <sighs> so this is that's more what it looks like. <laughs> that kind of game is exactly normally what it looks like. They just straight out the gate, they just go ramp, 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 ramp. Oh, not bad. Got to six. That's actually not bad. Not bad. Okay, guys. Well, thanks for watching. I hope that helped a bit. I mean, this game is quite hard to read Japanese. Um, because it's kind of dealing with a lot of historical stuff, old, old, you know, kind of fancy, complicated words, magic, and all that kind of stuff. But it is good fun to use it as, as practice anyway. All right, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. I'll try this again later, I think. Bye-bye.